recently I got a question with regards to if I'm working in an assembly and I start creating all my, my 2D drawings um, and then I want to check everything and how do I go about checking the drawings in as well? Because, you know, they only knew about, you know, you right click on the assembly, you check in, you know, what it does, it takes a look at the assembly and all the parts over here. Um, you know, if you have to go to settings, you know, include your children, include parents, direct parents only, uh, you know, create your visualization, attachment file during check-in or send to job server. But, you know, with this relationship, include children or include parents, you know, that parent over there is the parent for the assembly that you are checking in. Now, now I can go over there, say, okay, it checks everything in. But now my problem over here is that I've got a whole lot of 2D drawings that I need to go and um, to that I need to go and, and, and find and, and check in. Because if I, you know, so look, if I had to go and um, create a, a drawing for one of these components. So let's go open up this part over here. Right click and create drawing view. And we go create our 2D drawing from here. Okay. So once that's done, you know, you go save, saves as the part 0341. And go to my vault, okay? It's it's not inside the vault, okay? But I say, okay, cool, I'm done with this, and I go, okay, cool. Now, if I want to go and just check this in over here, um, I say check in. It will go and check the assembly. But what if I want to check up that IDW? So at the bottom of here, we've got a related files. Go look for them. And you'll notice there it will go and pick up that 1301-0341 IDW and check that in. So, you know, with that, you might have found that I've got, if I had to go to where this is saved on my, my desktop, there's a whole lot of IDWs or 2D drawing, drawing files that I've forgotten to check in. But they exist, and I want them inside the inside the uh, in the vault. So go up to my main assembly, vault, check in, or you can click on the vault tab at the top, right click, check in, or we can go to our vault tab at the top over here and check in. Once that's done, <coughs> picks up all the files that I'm going to check in. And I don't don't keep files checked out. And then from this, I'm going to click on this little button over here, Related Files Are Excluded. Select that. It goes and looks for those related files. So that you can see there, I've got one, two, three, four, five IDWs that I've seemed to have missed. So once it's there, I can go put in a comment, click on OK, and it'll go check all of those files back in again. So now what I've done is I've gone up to my assembly, I've checked all my part files in, and then what I've also done is said just you know check if there are any drawings for anything in there, sub faults, uh, sub assemblies, you know parts in that in assembly, find them and check them in as well. And that's how you can easy very very easy go and check everything in without having to go to them individually or searching for them in the vault, finding them individually and checking them in. Thanks very much for watching.